Good morning, students. It is, is it Wednesday, the 16th. So this is the work I asked you to complete with a partner yesterday in class. Hopefully you used your vocab list. So section D, um, number one is 21, number two, 83, number three, 64, number, number four, 47, number five, 15 is 15, 71, 71, 52, 99, 36, 36, 18, 18. So writing the words in Spanish, Number one is cuatro, C-U-A-T-R-O. Number two, cincuenta y cuatro, C-I-N-C-U-E-N-T-A, space, Y, space, C-U-A-T-R-O. Number three, the number is nueve, N-U-E-V-E. Number 22, uh, 22, V-E-I-N-T-I-D-O with an accent S. Number five, 83, ochenta y tres, O-C-H-E-N-T-A, space, Y, space, T-R-E-S. Number six is once, O-N-C-E. Number seven, 76, setenta y seis, S-E-T-E-N-T-A, space, Y space, S-E-I-S. Eight is 16, dieciséis, D-I-E-C-I-S-E with an accent, I-S. Number nine, 41, cuarenta y uno, C-U-A-R-E-N-T-A space, Y space, U-N-O. And 35, 35. T-R-E-I-N-T-A space Y space C-I-N-C-O. Doing the math. Ochenta más cinco, ochenta y cinco. O-C-H-E-N-T-A space Y space C-I-N-C-O. 19 plus 30 is cuarenta y nueve. C-U-A-R-E-N-T-A space Y space N-U-E-V-E. 100 minus 82 is dieciocho, D-I-E-C-I-O-C-H-O, just like we have up here in number 10. Uh, number four, catorce mas trece is 27, 27, V-E-I-N-T-I-S-I-E-T-E. -E. Number five, cincuenta mas cuarenta, noventa, N-O-V-E-N-T-A. Number six, setenta menos sesenta is diez, D-I-E-Z. Number seven, siete por tres, seven times three, veinte uno, V-E-I-N-T-I-U-N-O. And 99 minus two is noventa y siete, N-O-V-E-N-T-A, space Y space S-I-E-T-E. -E. Of course, you can rewatch the video if you need these answers again, or you can check with someone else. All right, so in class today, you are going to play a little tic-tac-toe. You'll get a, a sheet like this. So you and a partner, you're going to say the number in Spanish and mark with an X and an O. So like in the first board up in the top left, if I want to put an X under 14, I would say to my partner, 14, and I'd put an X there. Then my partner goes, let's say they want to go in the bottom right corner, and instead of saying 4, they accidentally say 24, 24. Just correct them politely and say, oh, I think it's 4, and then they can put an O there, all right? So the idea here is you're... Going through and playing tic-tac-toe, saying the numbers in Spanish, use your vocab list. That's totally appropriate. So use your vocab, vocab list. Help each other out. Just playing a little tic-tac-toe. There's 12 games here. So when you are done with those 12 games, go up to Mrs. Berg. And the winner between your, you and your partner will get a piece of candy from the bowl that I have on the shelf. So... Um, Figure out who, the, who wins the most games. If you're tied, do rock, paper, scissors for a winner. So this should take about 15 minutes or so. So once again, you're just playing tic-tac-toe, saying the numbers in Spanish, marking with an X and an O. See who wins the most games. Be courteous to each other. Help each other out if they say the wrong um, number. And then get a piece of candy for the winner. So your homework assignment, though, is in Canvas. Let me see if I can navigate to Canvas. There should be an assignment in there for you once I get to my Exploring World Languages page. Let's see if I have one here. It's not there. Let's go to the other one. Let's see. An assignment. It is not there either. Um, it may not show up just yet because it hasn't been assigned, but I will. Uh, I did assign it, but if for some reason it's not working, 
if it doesn't work, Mrs. Berg will have some copies for you, but let me show you what it is. What it is, is similar to what you did with your partner yesterday, section 11. Simone is working in the school bookstore, taking orders um, for each number of yearbooks ordered, write the correct numeral. Section 12, there's some numbers there. You are spelling those numbers out. Section 13, you're just doing a little math. Like in the example, they said two plus three is five, so dos y tres son cinco. So for number one, you'd write cuatro y cinco son nueve. Do that. 15 is just some phone numbers. Phone numbers, you have to figure out 31, 42, 65. So on the list on the right, you have to figure out which one is 31, 42, 65, which happens to be letter E. So you'll mark letter E there. And then at the bottom, you're doing these higher numbers. So remember uh, yesterday I talked about the number ciento. When you have more than 100, you use ciento. So like un televisor, it would cost $198. You write ciento noventa y ocho. So you're spelling those numbers out. Do your best. Like I said, you can work together. Use your vocab list and you'll submit this. Um, hopefully it shows up in the Canvas assignments. Um, it did in, on, my, on my side, on my computer. So I'll take a look at it again. If it doesn't work, um, then Mrs. Berg will have copies for you as well. So that is due on Thursday, all right? So we checked page three, which you did with a partner yesterday. You're gonna play a little tic-tac-toe and you're gonna complete this assignment. I may attach it as well in the Canvas announcement so you can complete it that way and, and maybe submit it or just hang on to it and until I come back on Monday too. That is perfectly okay, but make sure you complete this. Uh, read the directions, pretty straightforward. Do your best with the spelling and we'll move on from there, all right? Thanks for being great and I'll have another video for you on Thursday, hopefully. Take care.